And I needed $5 million to make a film. I wanted to raise the money because the people I was asking that I thought would just loan me the $5 million was asking for 50% of my company. <laughs> Real friends. For $5 million. <laughs> Good friends. I'm telling them this is going to be a multi-billion dollar company. They give me $5 million, they want 50%. I was like, I'm not getting jerked. Right? So people told me, they said, Irv, you got the money, just use your masters as leverage. So that's what I did. I did a deal with this company called Sound Royalties, and they gave me $5 million. I had to give them a, a big interest rate. I had to pay them back like $6 million. $6 million for $5 million? Yeah. It's like a loan shark. But I didn't care because I had a situation set up with Paramount and Bob Backish that I felt very strong that if I made the movie for five, I would get back seven to ten. So... If you know me, once I once I want to do something, I'm doing it, right? There's no looking back. I got tunnel vision. I don't give a fuck. I'm going. So basically, when I did that, the word got out that I'm doing shit with my masters. Zach Horowitz, great friend of mine, he was the COO of the Universal Music Group, and he called me and he's like, "Irv, you 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 want to sell your masters?" I said, "Well." I borrowed money against it. I ain't sell them. He said, but do you want it? I said, well, if the, if the price is right, I said, I want to make TV and film and I want to own it. I want to have the money to pay for it, to own it. He said, there's this guy, Olivier Chaston. He, he pays the most for masters. And he plugged me with him. As soon as I met Olivier, it was like a love fest. And he gave me a like 27X. He gave me a big multiple. You know, they buy my masters. So Ben was like, so why why are you selling your masters if you might, if 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 he said, if I could ask you. And I said, Well, I'm selling my past to ignite my future. I said, I want to pay for my own TV series, pay for my own films, so I could own it a hundred percent and build that catalog up just how I built my music catalog. He said, well, I'll give you $200 million. <laughs> Coming from where I, I come from, the nigga said, you're giving you $200 million. So my immediate response was like, so what you want, like 50% of my company? Oh, 80%? <laughs> He's like, nah, I don't want nothing. He said, I just want whatever money that you borrow from me, pay me back 8%. I said, that's it? He said, that's it. I couldn't believe it. And the man was offering me a 200 million line of credit and didn't want a percentage of my company. So he said, you know, you don't have to spend that 100 for your masters. He's like, we'll give you the money to make your product. And I needed $5 million.